Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today from 1001 Sandwiches of 1936, we're gonna be making the bacon, yay, and chicken liver, ugh, sandwich. Uh, as you can tell from my reaction, I'm not awfully big on awful. <laughs> I'll show myself out. Um, but it is what it is, let's cook some chicken liver. So I add a little salt and pepper and I'm gonna cook it on one side for three minutes, flip it over three minutes on the other side. Hopefully that does the trick. Now it says to put the uh, bacon and liver through a food chopper. It doesn't say how much of either, so uh, hopefully I've got more bacon than liver. <laughs> Just a few pulses here on my mini prep. Yeah, that's not looking great, but hey, now we get to mix it with mayonnaise. Doesn't say how much. Then we put that onto bread. It says, uh, quote, mix for an appetizing sandwich. Well, not an appetizing looking sandwich, but an appetizing sandwich. Okay, let's give this bacon and chicken liver sandwich a go. The bacon is good. I like mayonnaise. Still not a fan of liver. Um, I can't really describe how it tastes, but the chicken liver just doesn't taste good to me. Um, so, ugh. Uh. Yeah, I'm not gonna plus that up because I really do not enjoy the base sandwich. Uh, here's the deal, if you like chicken liver, this would actually be pretty good. Uh, the bacon is nice, the mayonnaise is nice. The bacon brings a little smoky flavor to it, which is great if you like chicken liver. Now, me, I'm gonna give that original sandwich a two. I am not gonna finish that, I am not gonna plus it up. If you like chicken liver, this would probably be like a five and a half or six. Um, but yeah, not, not, not for me. <laughs> All right, I gotta find something else for lunch. See you tomorrow.